What's good with it? Black Goose TV family as always. Double salute coming your way, man. Make sure when y'all come up in here, hit the subscribe button, like the video, show some love, comment, notification, all that good stuff. Now, look, we got some news. We got some things we need to talk about. We got some uh, 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 some boxing uh, uh, disrespect. Uh, some may call it coming from Eddie Hearn aiming at Ryan Garcia. We all know Ryan Garcia is going to be fighting Javier Fortuna this upcoming Saturday. By the way, make sure y'all check out that Fluence Lounge. We definitely going live for that joint. Um, but uh, uh, Eddie Hearn, it seems, and we all are aware, of course, of the Canelo and, you know, Ryan Garcia beef so far. Floyd Mayweather is signed with Canelo. Um, Oscar De La Hoya, of course, is back in his guy, Ryan Garcia. Um, it seems like Frank Sanchez is staying mutual, but uh, he kind of lurks a little bit more on the Garcia side. Uh, just, you know, from him, you know, going with, with the same camp as him, training under Joe Goosen. Uh, and then you got, of course, Andy Ruiz, you know, where Andy Ruiz is kind of, you know, playing the middle fence, but kind of leaning toward Canelo to an extent because he always wants to keep that door open. Uh, so it's, it's interesting what's going on right now, right? Uh, in this particular uh, 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 beef, you could call it, or disagreement, whatever the case may be. Now, with that being said, and it's, and it's interesting too because you got to remember uh, when Ron Garcia was with Eddie Reynoso and Canelo, man, it was like Canelo took him under his wing. So uh, that's why you, where you see such a big divide where certain people really disrespect Ryan Garcia because they're such big Canelo fans and they feel like he's wasting away his talent, blah, blah, blah. Then you have people who's Ryan Garcia fans or someone in the middle and they're just saying like, hey, let the young man do what he wants to do. Um, there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? It's his future. It's his choice. But now with that being said, now we have Eddie Hearn getting himself into the mix and he has some things that he wants to say and either does he genuinely mean these statements is the question or do you think he's just you know just showing his allegiance and saying hey uh canelo is my guy and if i'm going to speak on this beef i may not have to directly speak on it but i can indirectly maybe throw a little shade or you know throw a little saltiness over and the golden boy promotion camp by coming at ryan garcia now i'm gonna say this too this is this isn't an unpopular opinion at least from what my eyes have seen, um, it, it, it definitely seems like there is a uh, good amount of people who are right now uh, not in favor of Garcia. And either they hope he loses or they really do think that he isn't that good. And they think that Javier Fortuna is going to be that guy to expose him. Now, um, me personally, I don't think that's the case. I think actually Garcia is going to shock a lot of people. I think we're going to see uh, because I think a lot of people are going off of that to go fight. Um, where he didn't very, look very good, and I and I and I admit that 100. You know, uh, we went fluent lounge for that, me and Zen, and we were not impressed. I think there was another fight going on at the same time, and we were kind of mad that we, you know, ended up choosing the Garcia fight and, uh, to watch. But I'm all, we, we always gonna support hometown, anyways. A lot of people are getting based in and speculating off of that last fight, but I really, you know, that was his first camp with a new trainer. Um, this is gonna be a second one. Uh, also remember he had that long layoff so this is very you know it hasn't been that long since he's been he was in the ring and went 12 rounds with to go which is good for him really in the long run i think we're gonna be shocked i think he's gonna knock out for two i think he's gonna catch him with a hook i think him being south paul is gonna be perfect for him i think he's gonna capitalize off that he's gonna catch him with a quick hook for two is gonna be surprised about how fast he is and it's probably gonna happen quicker than a lot of people think that's gonna be a third round ko that's my personal opinion i'm gonna have to back that up once fluence comes. comes. make sure y'all check it out but how much do you believe eddie hearn when it comes to this particular statement do you agree with him uh let me know in below in the chat eddie hearn thinks ryan garcia loses to javier fortuna and of course we got to go to the direct quote because you know what i'm saying it ain't it ain't gonna be right if, if we don't go to the direct, direct quote, you know what I'm saying? We got to listen to that choice. So uh, let me scroll my way on down. Massive fight, two different fan bases. It's a huge fight, says Eddie Hearn to the zone Boxing Tank. Excuse me, his boxing show about his thoughts on the potential fight between Ryan Garcia and Javante. I have, excuse me, I haven't seen a lot of Fortuna, but if he's the same fighter he has been, I think it's going to be a very tough night's work for Ryan Garcia. I don't think, and I'm only watching Ryan Garcia at the gym like a lot of fans are. I'm not sure he beats Fortuna. So, um, right there in that statement, I could pick that statement apart because he says, I haven't seen a lot of Fortuna, but if he's the same fighter he has been, I think it's going to be a very tough fight. Uh, so I'm not sure if he's saying he hasn't seen a lot of Fortuna lately. Um, so he doesn't know if he's still the same fighter or is he just saying, period, he hasn't watched a lot of Fortuna. I, so I'm not I'm not sure how to take that statement. I'm going to go with the first, you know, uh, uh, side of the game that I said. I think he hasn't seen a lot of Fortuna lately, but he's saying if he's the same fighter he has been, uh, it's going to be a tough night for Ryan Garcia. I'm going to tell you this right now. He's not the same fighter, but he's definitely still uh, uh, nowhere near done in the sport. It's going to be a tough fight, but I think it's tailor-made for a young gun like Ryan Garcia and what he's capable of. But he's basically saying, and he's admitting, and it seems like it's an honest thing, um, even though I still think there's shades of him, you know, showing who his allegiance is because I'm like, come on, like you really don't believe in Ryan Garcia's skill like that? You really don't think he's going to be Fortuna? 
So that's that's an interesting statement, but you can tell he really means it. So uh, I'm not sure if this fight plays out so easily as some people think it's going to play out on Saturday, which is great news. So make sure you tune into the zone to watch it because it's going to be a great fight. Yes, absolutely. Said Hearn when asked if he'll be impressed if Ryan Garcia scores a big knockout against the 33-year-old for Tuna. So, you know, uh, he's, he's not capping. It seems like a pretty honest statement for the most part. I'm not mad about it in any type of way. Um, but, you know, with that being said, I still, you know, I still think it's really just him really just trying to show his allegiance, really, honestly, to, uh, you know, to his guy, you know, Canelo. And, it, you know, that makes 100 percent sense. Like, that's what you should be doing. You know what I'm saying? You should be showing your allegiance. You should be showing your respect. Um, but he's doing it in an undercover way. He's just doing it a smart way. He's a promoter. He makes all this money. He does what he does. You know what I'm saying? You can't uh, you can't be surprised by that. So salute to Eddie Hearn on that side of the game. Uh, but what do you guys think? Now, what are you guys' opinion on this particular video, man? Um, do you agree with that statement? Do you think it's wrong? Do you think it's false? Um, where are you siding when it comes to this? Do you think it's a close fight? Or do you think, you know, Ryan Garcia is going to do what he do? You know what I'm saying? So uh, let me know as always, man. Drop it below in the comments, man. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. Show some love. Uh, don't be scared, as always, to get me into the motherfucking algorithm. Yeah, man. Let's, let's get the subscribers up, man. Let's shoot for 5K by the end of the year. You feel me? 5K subscribers all together, man. Be part of the Black Goose family. Let's get it. You already know what it is. On sports, niggas side of the game. I'll be back with more boxing.